Hello and welcome back. We have a special recipe tonight sent in from a viewer. I want to thank her. And Rui wants to thank her as well. It's Kimmy's Crazy Kale Salad. We're excited to make it and we'll show you how to do it. Yep, so gather your materials and let's get started. First thing you want to do is bake the almonds for about 10 minutes at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. I had something in the oven at 400 and added it to it and it came out just fine. Next, remove the stems from the kale. Take the leaves and roll them up. Now you can thinly slice the kale into strips more easily. Place the thinly sliced kale into a large bowl, not a medium one like me. Set that aside and we'll add ingredients to it later. In a small bowl, Add a half cup panko breadcrumb. Finally chop one or two cloves of garlic and add them to the breadcrumbs. Add a quarter teaspoon of salt to the bowl. Now you can set this bowl aside. Next, thinly slice an apple. Make it so thin you can almost see through it. I used a Cosmic Crisp apple. It's a new variety that tastes a little like a honey crisp. When all the apple is sliced, Add them to the kale bowl. Next, add the cheese. I chose Pecorino, but Parmesan should do as well. Slice it into small chunks and add it to the bowl. Add as much or as little as you would like and set this bowl aside. When the almonds have cooled after taking them out of the oven, roughly chop them and set them aside. Juice half of the lemon and set it aside. In a small saucepan, add a half a cup of dried cranberries or raisins and add two tablespoons of white vinegar and two tablespoons of water. Move this saucepan to the stove. Heat the saucepan gently until the liquid has evaporated. The berries should be plump. You can set that aside now as well. Put the breadcrumbs in a pan and toast them in about a tablespoon of olive oil. Make sure to stir around for an even toast and cook until golden brown. Now all that's left is to assemble the salad. Add one tablespoon olive oil. Add the half lemon juice. Next, the toasted almonds and cranberries. Toss the salad a few times. Drizzle it with balsamic vinegar. And finally, Top with the toasted panko. This kale salad bursts with flavors. I'm telling you, you're gonna love it. This would be a great salad to bring to a potluck. I might would double though, because we ate ours in one night and that's only two people. Thanks again for watching. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you next time.